Should check the app. See what's good. Someone lost their cat? Sure, I can help with that. Helicopters for real? I can't! Someone's jammed the controls! Helicopters are there, there, and there.
Okay, time to worry about the transmitter. One down, two more. for the transmitter. One more. You all right, helicopter dude? We're steady for now, but I need full control back. Okay, I'll fix it. Fighting us was a mistake, Spider-Man! <laughs> Roxanne's still after you. You should get out of here. Consider it repayment. <laughs> no more spinning blades of death. That was so good. Hey, Nev. Meet me at the docks in Hell's Kitchen. I'll be there. What am I gonna do about Finn? Try talking to her again? I could meet her somewhere. The Science Center or Trinity Church? No. She knows I lied to her now. She won't want to see me. <sighs> Stop me if you've heard this. Spider... Outnumbered and still came out on top. That should be the missing cat man. Hey, you having cat troubles? Yeah. Vector, my cat, ran out while I was grabbing the mail. Here, he loves this bag. If you find him, he'll crawl right in. Are cats in backpacks like a thing? Uh, do you have anything with Vector's scent? Right here. His favorite toy. Cute. Quick scan. And I got a trail. Hold tight. Vector's coming home. Up onto those school buses. Little guys nibble. Is that a... Yep. Dead rat. Good for Vector. Sad for rat. On the right trail, though. Went under the bus. Into the sewers. I'll follow from street level, thank you. 
Hope Vector's owner doesn't mind owed to dead rat in sewer water. Nope. Vector didn't surface here. And come out here. Please don't make me go sewer splunking, Vector. The trail picks up. He climbed out here. Saved from a sewer search. Never would have gotten that smell out of my suit. by the laws of nature. <sighs> Went under that HVAC stuff. Time to crawl. Victor! Hold up, bud. Coming! Found you! Oh, boy. You got that real New York smell now, Vector. Wow. Time to head home. Here you go. Thank you. Ooh, wow. That's the smell. Oh, Vector, you've earned a full body scrub, pal. Cute cat, but mad cute. I need to cruise home and get my daily loot drop. Later. some rumors making the rounds of the pool halls and sleazy bar. Supposedly, Wilson Fisk has been trying to destabilize Harlem in order to make it cheaper and easier. I gotta call you back. Oh. Hi, Miles. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Finn, rocks on, underground. It's just... a lot, you know? You're 17. You're stressed. And you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? And not much since I started... this. Work-life balance, kid. Most important thing. Here. Little project your dad and I started back in the day. Our mixtape. Had rhymes ready and everything. <laughs> How come I never heard about this? Because we never finished. We sampled street noise around the way. Wanted the city to be our beat. But your dad had the masters. And after things went bad between us... <sighs> but you can finish what we could. Plus, it'll take your mind off work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What do I do? Load that up. I'll walk you through it. I set up holograms to guide you. Scan the source. Holograms, huh? You still in my moves? <laughs> this was in my playbook before you were even born, young blood. <sighs> okay, don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms, and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Help you figure out which sound you're looking for. 
Now try and find the original sound and grab a clean sample. Great levels. You're in the pocket. Not a match, though. Keep looking. Need to be a little closer to get your levels right. Good sound, but it's muffled. Try and get a clear line of sight. Make sure you've got a clear line of sight. Don't want any distortion. Need to get a little further away so it doesn't distort. But not quite what we're looking for. Good sound, but it's muffled. Try another angle. There you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. Rest of the sounds you need are spread across the city. I left a few messages for you, too, to help you get a feel for each location. Oh, dope. Not now. Hey! Get something you like? Yeah, really unique dynamics. See? Old man still knows his stuff. And you were right about clearing my head, too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone should. <sighs> you know, you said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was... complicated. We were too similar, and too different. <sighs> Finish the tape, get all the samples, and you'll hear the whole story. Promise. All right, thanks, Unc. Trinity Church. Remember, Tinker is yours, but leave the boy alone. Man, I 
needed that. I was beat. Okay. I'm gonna call Finn. As soon as I'm ready to go. Mom? Genki? Anyone home? I think it's just me. Mom's room's starting to look like Mom's room. I think that's a well out of protest back in the day. Political fire runs in the family. Bet Abuela has some choice words about our current situation with Roxanne. Mom's killing it. No way she's gonna lose. Bathroom has been a little crowded with me, Mom, and Genki all here. Hard to think of Ma as a little kid. A little music would be nice. Never gonna get tired of this one. Bridge attack didn't slow mom down at all. Kinda nice to have the apartment to myself. Well, it's still getting mail here. Gotta afford it to her. Doesn't love an old meter. Nobody. That's who. I wish you were still here, Rick. Me and Finn could definitely use your advice. <sighs> Things were a lot simpler back then. Glad my gear survived the move. Mom keeps talking about Imani during Kwanzaa. Up, Hard to have faith in his struggle when you read the news. Real heroes like you always do. Uh, I think my hair is frozen solid. I got better things to do. All right. Time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn. Hey. We need to talk. 
in person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please, meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies, I promise. If you're screwing with me, <sighs> fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay, Trinity Church, let's go. Convicts are down. How many of these guys are still running around? Your dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay, something rhythmic that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were little. Pretty sure it's behind me. gonna find it over here. I think it's back there. that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were little. probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from here, before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn or stop, always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space alien. Your dad's dream changed. Doctor, fire... Fighter, social worker but he always wanted to help me. Yeah, sounds like that. Stop. 
starting to recognize streets, shops, and some people. I just picked a helicopter for you. People are saying it's flying out of control. Something is seriously wrong with that helicopter. Time to hero up. What are you doing? Nothing, I swear! Thanks, moving on its own! Transmitter next. Spider-Man saves the day. themselves a new class of criminal, the Young Mafia, if you will. They wanted respect, so they went after the crime family. The conflict sputtered out when Hammerhead staged the full-on takeover of the Magia, which... Your mom lived here right after college. You know that? 
She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. Subtle, but a good beat. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop. And I just started calling myself the Prowler. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. Couldn't last, though. Your dad's job and mine crossed paths too often. Man, Uncle Aaron. If you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this park. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Loud in a group? Uh... Hmm. Probably something you'd always find here, like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees. Wonder if you'll get an action figure too? This was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day, and someone dropped a hot dog. You know how that goes. Place was swarming with pigeons. The dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, that's music. Listen. Next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan looking for beats. Like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the gear, and Dad had the ear for music. This is a good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Or something at the station.
yeah, that's cool. I think hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. He wanted to make things better from the inside. Pretty sure he died trying. He did make things better, Dad. And so will I. Times Square. Easy to find someone in the crowd here. Or lose them. Sounds you need's like an electric current. A current? I could cheat it with venom. <laughs> nah. Find it over here. Hey, Spider Man. Hello. Right there. New profile pic. Electric. Not this way. Oh, that's cool. Love how alive that feels. After I started calling myself a problem, met my first client. Sign. Neon flags hard to miss. The crowd makes it easy to blend in. She wanted me to steal the painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. He never said anything. Just turned and left. He didn't know everything. Just that I was a thief. That was enough. I think he saw when we were heading long before I did. He would have tried to act right sooner, he would have forgiven me. I know he would have. Hey friends, this is part of my series, Underground Exposed. I'm looking into who the Underground are and what they want, with the help of Spider-Man. I had to pinch myself when I said that. Okay, so. Underground used to have a major grudge against the inner demons, and not for the reasons everyone else. This sound always feels like someone celebrating, even when it's just telling time. Your dad thought so too, so we had to include it. A sound that tells time. Okay. Pretty sure it's behind me. Sun is bright. Happy holiday, Spider-Man. Have a good one. Old Spider-Man. Hey, I wasn't done. That's rude. I think it's back there. He said it sounded like a celebration. 
Daily loot drop. Later. I got better things to do. Come on! I'm not gonna find it over here. Ringing on the hour. When I hear those bells, I remember. The last time I was here, your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here after. He bought us milkshakes. Strawberry for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that right. I was lying. He didn't believe me for a while. Or at least pretended to. Man, things got complicated between them. This plaza and the blocks around it are alive with sound. What you're looking for is light, distinct. Light, huh? Okay. Jumping early. I like that beat. I'm not sure it's light, though. Something distinctive. Pretty shot your back, buddy. I think I saw some wind chimes. If I can get close enough. Gotta run. Probably something you don't usually hear in the city. Yeah. Wind chimes. Good. This plaza is where I had my first job. I was fresh out of high school then. Didn't have the gear or the mask. The guy paid me to mug his boss. Rough him up, take everything in his walk. Your dad found yeah. out. He stood under those wind chimes yelling at me for an hour. He never told our folks. He made me promise I'd stop stealing. Wish I kept my word. I wish you had too. Maybe you and Dad would have stayed close. I can't imagine ever turning my back on your family.
wouldn't know what I'd say. I'm just kind of doing my best, you know? <laughs> yeah, I think that's true for everybody, but your best includes dodging bullets and running up skyscrapers. Hmm. Maybe when I'm on summer break and have more time? I mean, uh, when I take vacation from work, from my job. Yeah. Anyway, if I was gonna go on any podcast, it'd be yours. That is the best compliment I've gotten all week. Maybe ever. <laughs> okay, well, um, just let me know when your summer break rolls around. Bye. Have fun with this one. I had a repeat client I always met here. Got real used to waiting. Listen, hearing this sound running on a tight schedule. A sound on a schedule? Watch it! I got enough trouble to Sound of something on a schedule. Whoa, alliteration. That's right. The client I met here used to take the ferry over from Jersey. Working for him was good money. Till it got busted. Here's how your dad found out about the problem. My dream was me that a thief was making it big in New York. And your dad volunteered for the case. I could feel him closing in. I had to try and guess which would be worse. I told him. Caught me. That was a hell of a way to tell me you're Spider-Man. What if I'd killed you? You want me to feel bad because you almost killed me? I want you to stop lying to me! I let you in the underground because I thought you understood. I do understand. What Krieger did to Rick? Roxxon needs to pay. Not like this. This is the only way I can beat him. I need you to look the other way. Please. I can't. I made a promise. So did I. Why'd you pick here? My dad brought us. To that concert. Seven choirs from seven countries. Remember? Ghana was my favorite. Ghana wasn't there. You're thinking of Guinea. I don't know, but I'm pretty sure it was Ghana. Guinea, Belize, Poland, Cuba. South Korea, Thailand, Venezuela. You're right. I usually am. Usually. <laughs> what?
gotta say, I'm disappointed, but... Oh, Krieger. Yeah. See, Miss Mason? Kinda knew she was gonna be a handful. You. I guess I was hoping that you and me would see eye to eye. Where are we? <laughs> You're behind the curtain, bud. <laughs> this is our most secure facility. And here the sausage gets made. You're a real prick, you know that? Hmm. You know, when her brother and I were developing new form... All you did was put your name on the patent. He said the only thing you knew how to do was sell other people's ideas. You know, at least I still got a pulse, babe! But let's not dwell, right? The first thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna... <clears throat> wow! <laughs> that is awesome. Are those involuntary defenses? Oh, man, that's hot. You see, I'm gonna get that mask off you. And I'm gonna find out what makes you tick. Because you just... smell like next-level bioengineering. And you know what that smells like to me, kid? <clears throat> That smells like money. Okay, I'm gonna hit the gym. Leg day, can't skip it. Get her to tell us where my new form is. <laughs> can't really open the plaza without it. Oh, and uh, use him. Time to finish what we started on the bridge. <laughs> no cameras now. <laughs> 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 Kill you. <laughs> Holy shit. Tougher than I look, huh? <laughs> Let's find a way out of here. Roxon kept Rhino instead of giving him to the police. It's crazy. Nothing about Roxanne surprises me anymore. You okay? I will be, once we're out. I'm shutting off security cams. Can you check that computer? What did you find? There's the exit, through this office. We have to lift the base lockdown first, from the control room. First, we need to escape the security wing. I'll go down to the floor, see what we're dealing with. Door's locked. Venom worked in the cell. She'll work on the door. I can find whatever's... Hello? It's unlocked. I'm headed to the floor. Right above you. That security door is our way out, but I'll have to hack a few terminals to disable the alarm. I'll handle the security guns. Security cameras are down in the south wing. Rhino probably turned them off. Heard he wanted to question the prisoners. Bet that other guy could get even Spider-Man to squeal. What's up with these power outages? Hold back. Packing some serious new firepower. Oh, oh, oh. Red. Can't believe we caught the Tinkerer and Spider Man. I should have picked up the ship. Way's clear. Running a 
decipher. Stand by. I heard something. We need another sweep. Okay. Ready for another computer. Finn, we gotta talk. Blowing up the plaza is a bad idea. So is poisoning the city with an unsafe fuel source. Yeah, but there has to be a better way to deal with Roxxon. Sometimes strategies are imperfect. Like deciding to lie to your friends. Let's just focus on getting out. Fine. But we're gonna talk about this. You gotta be quicker than that. Go alert, we've got an intruder. Keep searching and shoot on sight. I'm on sight. Huh? I'm not gonna You ask for this! That one hurt! Call that trick. Looks like some kind of record archive. Wonder what's on these computers. Looks like a voice memo from Krieger. I liked Rick Mason, I did, but bleeding hearts don't survive this business. Maybe we should set up a plaque in his memory or uh, oh oh uh name a bench after him. Huh. Yeah, I bet he'd love that. Simon Krieger. Bastion of compassion. More info on Rhino. I know he says he wants out of that suit, but let's face it, the metal onesie is the only reason anyone gives a damn about him. Just upgrade his armor. If we help him smash Kid Spider, he'll forget all about wanting out. There's nobody this guy won't manipulate. Notes about Roxxon independent contractors. We need an outside partner to track Tinker and Spider-Man for us. Tombstone's off the grid. Black Cat's gone straight-ish. What about the guy in the purple? Where'd he go by? What was his name? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, he'll do. Guy in purple? That can't be. No. No way. Hey. Roxxon's stealing your stuff. From what I hear, you are too. Thanks for that, by the way. Triggering the override. There's a voice memo on here. Sir, the police are asking about Rhino. What do we tell them? Our man at the Raft is setting up a special work release program. Tell the police Rhino's doing the little community service. Can't believe they got away with this. Doors unlocked, but I need you to force it open. Can do. Your muscle was only supposed to grab the girl. 
Yeah, he didn't like that. Here's the deal, bud. Spider-Man's the best leverage I got against Miss Mason. I mean, you caught them together. Well, I mean, you caught them, but it was thanks to your intel. So, clearly there's something going on there. You agreed to leave the kid alone. Uncle Aaron? Ah, the kid. I love how you say that. It's just so paternal. Let Spider-Man go, and I'll get you new. Feed you underground intel, whatever you want. See? Leverage works every time. My Spider-Man. Here's leverage for you. I've seen things. New form making people sick. What you did to Rick Mason. If I went public. Yeah, but you won't. Here's the deal. You're a wanted thief. Plus all the jobs we've done together. But you'd be in the cell right next to mine. And we both know you're a little too self-serving for that. So, we're gonna head in and check on Miss Mason and Spider-Man, uh, but it's kind of an invite-only party. Yeah. Bye. Roxxon, but I didn't think he'd... he'd sell me out. I can't believe this. You led me into a trap. Why do I keep listening to you? Ben, no. There has to be an explanation. I didn't know this would happen. Just save it. Let's keep moving. Can you get this open? Yeah, sure. So we need past those security shutters. Got a maintenance panel here, but it needs power. Let me see what I can do. Gotta be attached to a generator. There. It's got power. Accessing... Uh, I can't hotwire the shutters, but I can move machinery. Like that crane. Maybe we can use that. I'll look around. They build engines for their APCs in here. <laughs> Hey, I can raise and lower that crane. Is that useful? Hey, crane's over this engine thing now. Engine thing. I've got an idea. Can you move the crane back <sighs> to the assembly line? Yeah, I think I know where you're headed. Okay, this laser should activate the engine. Oh, crap. Laser sorted out. I think I can reroute power. The laser shorted, but it still works. Needs a new power source. those nodes and some webs. We route power to the laser. I'll make a new one, just give me a minute. That go 
glass is in the way. There's a note on that crane. Crane so my webs reach the laser. <clears throat> Gotta pull the crane back to where it started, then make the connection. You're good. Use a laser. One laser coming up. Perfect. If I overcharge the engine, it'll be explosive. And explosive is just what we need to destroy those shutters. Time to make it explosive. Get down! Let's go. Almost out. That's our way out. Give me a few minutes to get it open. Looks like they guessed our plan. Not hard. There's only one exit. All right. I'll take care of those guards. You get that door open. Ugh, one thing. Did you ever think about calling me to tell me you were Spider-Man? You know, after my parents died, Rick basically had to become my dad. I thought I'd miss having a brother, but I had you. Finn, I... Get this door open! That won't hold forever! Go! I'll be fine, just go! Those guys with the lights on their helmets can spot heat signatures. They'll see you if you try to go invisible. Wonder how much of their R&D department is dedicated to fighting us. Probably millions of dollars in untaxed money. You clear the floor, I'll work on overriding security so we can get out. I can still access machinery if you need me to move anything. are holding the door. Whole base is on alert, though, so be careful. Sector clear. There's only one way out of the base. We gotta come through here. I don't know. Anger. That one bites the dust. What's your status? RX-42 isn't responding. Check it out.
What can I do to change that? Stop going behind my back. And stop acting like I haven't thought this through. No one will get hurt when I take down the plaza. No one except Roxxon. You know they deserve it. Just promise to talk it through with me, okay? I promise to listen. Really listen. I've made up my mind, Miles. You need to start accepting that. Then, I'm gonna have to stop you. You need to start accepting that. I'm through. Meet me in the showroom on the far side of the assembly line. See you there. like they locked the doors. I'll find another way. What if we went public about Rick's death? Do you have proof? Because I don't think the word of two vigilantes is gonna convince people. There's gotta be a way. I think that's the exit. Hey. Lost and found. Thanks. I know this place. This is Krieger's lab. Krieger has a lab? Mostly for show, but yeah. Rick showed me a photo once. Krieger's lab? Wait. All the current new firm project data is on here. Toxicity reports, failed safety reviews, and Krieger's name's on everything. This would destroy Roxxon. You like my new color? Immune to your little zappy pops. Zappy pops? Come on, man. Now, we finish this! Yeah. Why do you sound so tired? 
Just make sure he doesn't do anything. I'll be right back. Krieger Sato shut Roxxon down the right way. You know, Krieger told me how your brother died. Very amusing. Shut up. <laughs> He also told me it was your fault. <laughs> Krieger updated the reactor. Tried to supercharge it to make his deadline. If thing goes through with her plan... Oh my god. Harlan. You ought to die.
my family's dead. Genki. I need help. I'm gonna go grab a washcloth. Some antibiotics. attacking the plaza yeah so that was you chasing her through the city as spider-man you could have died no lo puedo creer. why didn't you tell me about any of this all those talks we had how to keep yourself safe I didn't want you to worry. And the other Spider-Man's gone. I just keep making things worse and worse. Now I screwed up things with you. Miles. There is nothing you could ever do or ever be that would make me stop loving you. Nada. You give me strength, Miles. That's all a hero really is. Someone who's brave for the people they love. Just a guy who doesn't give up. Gloria's handling feast, and Teo's gonna help us go door to door. Perfect. Let's get this evacuation started. I'll meet you outside. You remind me more of your father every day. You stay safe. Well. Hey, I'm telling people in Harlem they need to evacuate before me and your mom go door to door. Okay, cool. I I wanted to say thanks for always having my back, man. Hey, I could use your help before you go. You got it. I want to cross-reference underground activity with buildings that could store a new form. Maybe you could hack Oscorp surveillance towers, or... I'm in. It'll take a while to narrow down. That's all right. Thanks, man. Gonna stretch my legs a little, then head out. Gonna take some time to work on music when this is all over. I'll make this right. For all of us. Whatever's about to go down in Harlem, I hope our play survives it. A lot of strong people in my family. Time to live up to it. Definitely feeling like mom's space now. Looking better than I did when I got home. I'm not giving up, Dad. Not sure a pre hero wing snack is the best idea right now.
Your mom texted. She's working on this building, then heading down the block to evacuate people closer to the plaza first. You still gonna help? Totally. As soon as I find Finn's latest new form setup. What do you think I should say to Finn when I find her? I don't know, man. Get the new form from her. Then you can offer the olive branch. Yeah, hope it goes better this time. You think you have enough time to get people out of Harlem? Depends how long it takes Finn to finish making the new form explosive. You're right. I should get moving. Tracks down Finn. 
I should check the app. See if people need help. I don't know. After everything with Krieger, it's fine. I'll keep my guard up. Subway tunnels. Guess a good thief needs a good hideout. Whoa! I'm kind of jealous of his lair. The lab. The basement thing. Always making upgrades. I definitely got my suit patching skills from Uncle Aaron. My mom bought him this at a flea market. It was a joke about... Uh, can't remember. Uncle Aaron's got tabs all over the city. He must have been building his network for years. Sequencer? Sampler? Vintage? Oh, has to be him and Dad's equipment. He was always way better at guitar than me. He used to come to our place for dinner all the time. Guess he never learned to cook. Maybe I should take a few swings. Nah, I'd probably break it. Use the sounds. Frequency lock? <laughs> Something new every day. Hey, kid. Hope the suit fits. You asked why me and your dad stopped talking. He was investigating the Prowler. It led him to my clients, people like Simon Krieger, Wilson Fisk. But dad couldn't afford to make enemies like that. Not with you and Rio in the picture. So I told him. Hoped he'd back off, and he did. For good. He didn't want me around. Didn't want you to turn out like me. Hope this suit helps you be better. Take care, Spider-Man. Thank you. Glaren. For every...
Hey, I found Finsetta, the Oscorp Science Center. It's closed for renovations. Our energy converter. That won the middle school science fair. That's how she's gonna finish making the new form unstable enough to blow up Roxxon Plaza. Whoa. It's like she picked it to get back at you. Maybe she did. <sighs> Thanks, Genki. It's my job. Speaking of, time to help your mom evacuate Harlem. Later. Okay. Oscorp Science Center. Finn needs to know what'll happen if she goes through with her plan. And if she won't listen, I'll take the new form. Destroy it if I have to. Crap! It's Spider-Man! Ditch the stuff! Those better be water guns! If they're not, guess I had to stop you! Taking you down! Sorry about this, nephew. Can't let you go back out there. Let Krieger and the Tinkerer kill each other. Go back to being Spider-Man when the heat dies down. And what? Just hide down here? I don't get to pick and choose when I'm Spider-Man. I gotta stop Finn. No, you gotta survive. I've been trying to teach you that, but you don't listen. You want me to survive so bad? Why sell me out to Krieger? Wasn't a sellout. <sighs> yeah. I'm serious. You were never supposed to get caught. Krieger broke our deal. You want it back in the family. And that's the best you could do? I saved your life. You threw me in a cell. To protect you. Like this is protecting me? Damn it, Miles. I'm not gonna lose you, too. And I'm not gonna let people die just to save my skin. You underestimated me. <laughs> <laughs> Dad can see 
serious now. Pete understand that I gotta protect you. trying to save you and I'm trying to save everyone else <laughs> <laughs> enemies you can't beat. Know who else did that? Don't say his name! You want your mom to bury you too? I won't let you. Holograms? More tech from your buddies at Roxxon? I attack. You can't keep up. You're naive, nephew. Still the kid looking up to Spider-Man. No. I'm the kid who knows people are looking up to me. You're never gonna accept me as Spider-Man. The risk I gotta take? You're right. I'm done letting my family die trying to play hero. How far 
I know I messed up. I let you down. We're family. Family? That didn't stop you from lying to me, manipulating me, fighting me? Being family isn't enough anymore. Doesn't have to be like this. You, me, hating each other? That's how it happened between me and your dad. I don't want to repeat that. I don't either. But I can't be the person you want to turn me into. I can't turn my back when people need me. I have to be better than that. Genki, my uncle just kidnapped me. Locked me up. What? Dude, are you okay? I had to fight him. Then I said, I, I told him, we're done. For good. I'm sorry. That's... That can't have been easy. It's what I had to do. I'm headed to the science center. Call me if things get bad in Harlem. I will. Good luck, Spider-Man. Seeing close renovation and the underground moves right in. Finn's gotta be inside. Hope I can be there to see the explosion. It'll change everything. Finn's ran the city for years. After the plaza, we'll take its place. Get away from me, suck it up. We don't have to... Yeah. <gasps> Huh. 
lab will rock some stuff. So we can spread our focus. Of course you will. Not under the Night. Lori, come in. Damn it. Someone check our position. <laughs> Bet you didn't see that coming. See what kind of security they've got. In those shacks, which are locked and powered down. Need a new power source. Like that giant spinning mobile. This will work. Bet I can web the nodes to the mobile. Conduct electricity. Just need the webs to reach. Webs won't reach.
Vicky and conducted. That's one. Feeling good. Oh, this is gonna work. This is working. A couple more. Yes. I saw one more. Can't believe how well this is working. Underground's toys. Finn, you here? Winning the science fair, getting to show off our converter here. We were so proud. <sighs> the exhibit was down that hall. Underground cash. Up there. Finn? Come on. We need to finish this. You and me. She's got to be with our project. Down that hall. rock again. Did I win or did she? Guess it doesn't matter now. our project while we're still young I'm coming I'm coming hey where'd they put us I've got the museum map on my phone our projects in a special exhibit on the top floor can't wait to see our names on the little sign like
real scientists. Today, Oscorp Science Center. Tomorrow, every major museum in the world. Didn't you use the data? Bounty farms are the key to sustainable, healthy living beneath the sea. Commercial and industrial algae cultivation is already used in a number of products, from colorants to pharmaceuticals. I wonder what algae tastes like. Probably kale. Ugh, I hate kale. Since the mid-20th century, scientists have envisioned human habitation beneath the sea. Looking out your window, someday, you might see the brightly striped clownfish, or even the menacing anglerfish. I'm naming that one Howard. You name one. Uh, Leviathan. Love it! This model combines the design of a submarine with the deep-sea integrity of an unmanned underwater vehicle. Oscorp's prototype would unlock new possibilities in humanity's ability to explore. <laughs> you and I gotta get one of these. Bet we could build one out of a vacuum cleaner and some old tires if we put our minds to it. Think underwater living sounds like science fiction? Think again. Underwater habitats have been used around the world. Since the 1960s, this model proposes a permanent residence beneath the waves. Today, New Yorkers are building up to save space. Tomorrow, we could be building beneath the sea. Pass. What, you scared? Of sharks, the dark, tiny enclosed spaces? It's a no for me. The Earth is bigger than you think. 95% of the Earth's oceans remain unexplored and could be the next frontier in human habitation. It's weird to think how little we know about our own planet. This dive suit is one of the first developed in the early 18th century. The first pressure-proof diving suit was developed with salvage work in mind. Today's suits such as these are used by salvage workers, scientists, and explorers. Think they'll let me try it on? Would love to see you try to walk around in that thing. Can't be worse than those shoes you wore to the spring dance. Oh, come on. Yours were at least an inch higher than mine. Let's go to the main hall. Never been here before. Gotta love that student discount. What do you think? Special exhibits upstairs. There's the elevator. We've got time to look around first. Did you call Doug back? He's gonna meet us at the restaurant. Architectural innovations are the key to human survival on extraterrestrial planets. This model home would protect human inhabitants from the low temperatures on Mars. Check it out. You want a house on Mars? Sure. If I could bring my mics, audio setup, sampler... They won't let you take all that. They will if they want good music on Mars. Using a shaped memory alloy, or memory metal, Oscorp scientists created this prototype of a metal that could change its shape while maintaining integrity. One day, memory metal could be used in many types of machinery. And even in your own home. Whoa, check it out. Metal that changes shape. I like the idea. 
But it looks kind of basic. Bet it could be improved. This model proposes a terraforming and housing initiative on Mars, our closest neighbor in the solar system. This community is designed to draw on abundant water and counteract low temperatures, making human life possible on the red planet. It's like a whole little community on Mars. Needs coffee shops and street art. spacecraft explore our planet, solar system, and galaxy. To communicate with them, scientists use radio antennas to send and receive messages across local and interstellar space. Oh, I bet the sound quality on these are dope. Not from space. Oh, come on, it's just button mashing. So you admit defeat? Never. Oh, faster! Come on, rocket buddy! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Go, 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 go! Gotcha! Found something I'm better at than you. Not for long. This Oscorp rover, adapted from models currently used on the moon, can be operated as a man or unmanned vehicle. Used to carry minerals and find water sources, the Oscorp rover would make exploration possible on Mars. Scans for minerals, carries people across toxic wastelands. What can't it do? Can you imagine driving this thing down fifth? Move, pedestrians. <laughs> heat and electricity for space stations, shuttles, and extraterrestrial settlements. These Oscorp stickers show how flexible and affordable solar cells can be. Go on, take a sticker. Ooh, shiny. Ooh, shiny? Those are portable adhesive solar panels. Ooh, portable shiny. Would you ever move to space? You know, if you could. Only if my family came too. I would. Or get into a galactic battle with aliens. Well, yeah, or that. When's Rick gonna get here? He just texted. Said he was headed into the subway. So it could be anywhere from 30 minutes to two hours? Basically. Do you have tickets for the special exhibit? Oh, um, our project is on display. Didn't think we needed tickets. You do. And we're sold out. Can't let you go upstairs. Thanks, anyway. So, we need another way in. She said there's no more tickets. Right, but see that door? The hallway behind it wraps around to the elevator. Can't just break in? We have to! They're taking down the exhibit tomorrow, and then we'll never see it!
Locked. I recognize that kind of lock. If you shine a light at it, it'll open. The flashlights on our phones would work, but they won't reach. They will if we find a way to slide something reflective under the door. Something reflective. It'd be nice to find something mutable. Mutable? You mean changes shape? Look at you breaking out the fancy vocab. <laughs> Shut up. Shape memory alloy. I could change the shape on the museum app. This stuff is crazy. Think it's a meta material? Must be. Wonder if it's using a phononic band cap. That's it. Take it. Don't let anyone see. Got it. Let's go. Whoa, oh, man. Oh. Sorry. All good. I still need something reflective. Look how the external tools interface directly with the command module's computer. We could recreate the idea, but with the neural interface. It would overload our central power. Not if we integrated it over the entire mesh from multiple entry points. Hmm. Do you think you can handle it? With enough time and a lot of coffee? Absolutely. <laughs> I'll supply the coffee. Well done, Peter. I couldn't do this without you. We should probably head back to the lab. We've overstayed our lunch break. Oh, Doc, I'm so sorry, but I've got to take the afternoon off. It's an emergency. Again? Peter, is something bigger going on? Perhaps at home? You know you can talk to me about it. I, I, I'm fine, but... I'm sorry to run out on you again. Not at all. Work will be waiting when you get back. Thanks, Doc. Integration over the mesh. That boy's mine. Look, solar mirrors, and sticky on the back. Perfect for tricking a light-sensitive lock. I'll put the sticker on the metal. Let's go. I've got the light. Tell me when the sticker's pointed at the sensor, and I'll turn it on. No one's looking at us yet. Gotta hurry. No, not quite. That worked! We did it! Come on, our project awaits. That was awesome. I'm gonna miss doing stuff like this with you. What are you talking about? Uh, hello? You'll be at Brooklyn Visions next week. I won't. I'm not gonna vanish off the planet. We'll still hang out. You'll be busy. Not that busy. I'm gonna make time for us. Seriously. Okay. Ugh, this is getting mushy. Come on, let's head upstairs.
Hey, Dad. Hey, Miles. Hi, Mr. Davis. Finn says hi. You kids having fun? Make sure you get a picture of your project. Dad, it's not a big deal. It's totally a big deal. Okay, okay. We'll get a picture. Love you, Dad. Bye. This is it. Our project's in the back. Think they got a converter all hooked up? Otherwise, what's the point? They'll need to feed biomass in, though. Maybe hook it up to a trash can. Oscorp Science Station, positioned at one of two stable Lagrange points between Earth and the Moon, could one day be a permanent home for human scientists and explorers. Man, it'd be so cool to live on a space station. is the key to our future as we explore interstellar space. Fuel efficiency and transportation will be vital components in reaching and settling planets at the far reaches of our solar system and beyond. Oscorp nuclear reactor. Rick's working on something that's supposed to make nuclear energy obsolete. Do we get to know what it is? Nope. Roxxon's keeping it super secret. Cultivating agriculture in nutrient-enriched fluids, what we call hydroponics, could make farming in space a reality. Wonder if they can grow flowers in space. They're probably more interested in food. Why? You trying to impress someone? I like to be prepared. In case I get a crush on a cute astronaut. <laughs> okay. One of humanity's greatest accomplishments came from the Apollo space program. We reached the moon. Since then, scientists have dreamed of traveling beyond and someday settling our solar system. Lunar module from the Apollo program. Hey, we can name our time capsule after that. How many Apollo missions were there? 16, 17, I think. Apollo 18. I like it. This engine, used in the Apollo space program, is one of the most powerful inventions that uses liquid fuel. Today, Oscorp is building on that technology to maximize fuel efficiency, making deep space exploration possible. The most powerful single nozzle liquid fuel rocket engine ever made. I'd love to build something like that. I need to get that picture of you and our converter for your dad. Not yet. I still haven't read everything. Our project. Oh, ho, ho, wee! Would you look at that? Genuine award winning scientists. No one told us we were in this special exhibit. Ticket only. How'd you get in? Uh, I bought a ticket. How'd you get in? Not important. <laughs> hey, huddle up. We need a picture. You gotta be in it too. You helped us get it working. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Scoot over. All right. Say alleles. I am not saying that. Finn, you need to know. 
I'm done listening to you. I had to tell her what I had for the reactor. I need to get to Harlem. Now, before Finn destroys the reactor. Yankee, talk to me. How's the evacuation going? Bad. Rocks on an underground are all over. It's like a war zone. Are you safe? My mom? We made it. There was about a dozen people. But... You're breaking up. 
Who are you? Genji! If you can hear me, I'm on my way. Hang tight, man. Please! Never seen a storm this bad. <sighs> Genki, can you hear me? Genki. Yeah. <laughs> 
Genki! Genki, where are you? Can you guys make a break for it? Who's that? Someone there? Guys! Guys! Listen, hey! We need to get out of here. I can only carry some of you. Oh, she started already. Get out of here, young blood! Whoa. Salty corn. You've got more important things to do. He's right. Go. We'll get people clear. I'll be back. I know. Okay, people! change the specs. You're not just gonna destroy Roxxon Plaza. You're gonna vaporize all of Harlem. I'm not gonna let you lie to me again! You're too late. you do this I can't let you stop me Finn, 
I knew cared more about protecting people than punishing them. It's the same thing! You should have stayed away! Don't you see what the reactor's doing? Destroying the plaza! Tearing down Krieger's monument! The more weapons you build, the more I'll destroy. Oh, I can keep this up all day, Miles! If the plaza melts down, it'll take Harlem with it! Who fed you that? Krieger? I ran the number! Too slow, Miles! Don't make me kill you! 
you! You can't win! Why do you keep fighting? Because... I'm... Spider-Man! <laughs> shouldn't be happening. I can stop it.
much longer.
Get out of here, kid. We'll take care of them. Did you see his face? You did good, Spider-Man. Thanks. Who is he? That guy? <sighs> He's our Spider-Man. Come on, those are clearly deep fakes. They're deep fakes. You understand me? Do you have any idea who I am? I will own you. Yeah, I will, yeah, we know ow, who you are. I will own you. Do you hear me? That's right, friends. Simon Krieger is in prison. Aaron Davis, aka the Prowler, flipped on him and Roxxon. Davis will serve time, but could get a reduced sentence. I think we can all learn something from what happened in Harlem. Together, we're stronger. And that having your own neighborhood Spider-Man is pretty great. You're looking good, Haley. This is where we come from, yeah, we did it. City on my back, I'm committed. This is where we come from, yeah, we made it. Now the whole team celebrating. We like, uh-oh, oh, 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 oh. Probably thought you knew a new day is approaching. Turn the brakes, guys, in the blue. I grew up on the same line. Yeah, school of hard knocks. Had to get in on the hard time. Took the hard shots, but we made it. Anticipated, highly decorated. The whole team is winning, hey, celebrated. Man, the victory is all mine. I'm all right, man. All mine. And everything is all right. All right. All right. Still can't get over that suit. So cool. Gotta be me. Yeah, you do. Pete, does this job ever get easier? Some of it, yeah. Some things never get easier, though. Roxxon did this uptown because they saw us as disposable. Me, Rick, Ben. All of Harlem. I think part of our job is making sure they can't get away with it. We'll add it to the Spider-Man oath. Go time? Go time. Tell me I was next. I'm coming for next. It really isn't no question. Only super hills in a section. Only big bangers on a set list. On top of buildings where I eat breakfast. And I shine like a new necklace. I'm ready. Vitals are good. Circulatory system healthy. Um, brain activity normal. He's been in there long enough. Mr. Osborne, I understand he's your son, but his I disease want it could. Kurt. Kurt. But we may be underestimating the potential danger. I said, get him out now.
Bye, Finn. Hey, Ma. You busy? Not too busy. What's going on? I just left Trinity Church. I was thinking about Finn. And... Uh, Tell me about it. She saved my life. And yours. Everybody's. But she's the one who put us in danger in the first place. After seeing what happened to Rick... I get why she did it. People are messy. Take your Uncle Aaron. He's the reason Krieger's in jail, and he helped us get people out of Harlem. But every time I look at him, I think of all the pain he put your dad through. Yeah. You don't need to make a judgment on Finn's life, Miho. Or her death. Just remember who she was, and why you loved her. You always know what to say. <laughs> That's my job. Call me back if you need me. Entiende? Si. Sí. Te quiero. Underground must be nearby if they're hijacking that billboard. Need to track that interference again. Locking on. Got the signal. Time to move. Those billboards could definitely be switched up more often. Just not with the Underground's logo. And here's the Underground. You sure you're getting more press with these billboards? Or just more of me? Really need to sleep.
Abuela. Your old TV is gone, but never forgotten. Quick nap. a clue for a scavenger hunt. Dad and I used to do these. Did she make a new one? I'm gonna check this out. See what mom put together. Should get out of here. Check out the Natural History Museum. City Councilwoman Rio Morales. Has a nice ring to it. I think I'm done in the apartment. I've been to the museum in forever. I think the last time was with Finn and Dad. Those trips are really fun. It's weird to think about now. Natural History Museum. Clue on the postcard said, facing the park with the world on our shoulders. We guard the next clue. Hmm. There's a statue of four guys holding a globe at the Central Park entrance. Might be what that clue means.
This one's of the Empire State Building. High atop the Empire State, you'll find a pair of blind eyes. There's a flash drive attached. Hey, big man. Happy birthday. Or down memory lane. Remember that summer you and Finn forced me to take you to the museum every weekend? Finn, I'd feel less guilty. You have a sister. Her. With Finn, and now Genki, you'll always have family in your life. Love you lots, big man. See you at the next one. Wow. I haven't heard his voice in so long. I hope he left more messages with the rest of the scavenger hunt. Hey, sleepyhead. Did you find my notes? Yeah. Followed the clue. You just heard that. Did you do all this? Just the setup. Your dad made the clues last year. I know it's been tough since the move. I thought hearing from him would help. It does. Gracias, ma. De nada. Have fun with him. And remember, I'm here if you need me, Miles. You can tell me anything. Te quiero. Te quiero. Who's about the binoculars on the... Remember that place. Find the fossil hiding among the modern. Don't forget to look up. Hmm. Fifth grade field trip. Empire State. I chaperone. <laughs> Never agreed to wrangle a bus full of ten-year-olds, son. It took us three hours to get here, and when we did, who showed up? The webhead himself. Battling vulture. As soon as we stepped off the elevator, we had to turn right back around again and evacuate. The thing I remember most, though, you wanted to stay. You told me, Spider Man needs our help, Dad. You're a born hero, Miles. Don't ever lose that fighting spirit. See you at the next clue. Born hero. I think I learned to be a hero from watching Dad. I miss him, especially now. Prototype labs in Manhattan are kaput. So are their reactors. Finally, with the labs in Krieger gone, feels like Roxxon's butt has been firmly kicked. I bet they'll be staying out of sight for a while. Good. Because I don't want to drain any more reactors. You said it, buddy. But I'm glad we were able to do this together. Me too. Until our next adventure? Which will probably be five minutes from now, right? <laughs> Deal. Here's the Modern Art Museum. Find the fossil hiding among the modern. Don't forget to look up. Hey, doesn't the museum keep a fossil on the balcony facing the river? Worth a look. Next clue. Looks like I'm going to see your DBs. 
Where money is king, you'll find great tunes hanging among the lights. I had to practically drag you in. Not an art museum the first time again. What do we care about splotchy paintings? But, your mom and I knew. We had to show you kids that there were different ways of looking at the world. Sometimes, radically different. When I saw you two in front of that psychedelic Angela Davis portrait, heads craned up and all, I knew you were ready. All that old and gold. Don't think you ever realized it. Really. You. Like. Proud of you making it this far. Let's see how you do with the next one. Finn and I talked about that trip for months afterwards. Mom and Dad really knew how to inspire. <laughs> DBs, let's hunt. Hanging among the lights. Hmm. The suit is still. Here we go. The lobster bills. Dad's favorite restaurant. Nestled beneath Stuyvesant, lives a monster of a good meal. It's gonna happen. My youth with CODBs with your uncle. Every musician we loved played at this crap little stage. Aaron even got up there once himself. He didn't do half bad either. When he finally told me about his night job, this is where he took me to soften the blow. And poison the place for me. Never took you here because of it. I regret that. You love it. Just like I do. So, how about this? Find a show you want to see. Anything, my trip. Come out here and the old man will show you how I used to bust a move. <laughs> Next clue's all yours, guys. Dad was gonna bring me to a show. Man. Need a minute after hearing that. Someone reported a civilian being attacked near you. Please don't! Hey! Uh, stop! This doesn't involve you, Fireman! <laughs> That's what you get for harassing people. Spider-Man! swinging behind you constantly looking over your shoulder now that I'm back. I trust you. And I have some stuff I should do. Lobster bills. Holy ground for dad. Nestled beneath Stuyvesant lives a monster of a good meal. Pretty sure I know which monster he means. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, yeah. The next clue must be on Bill the Lobster. Guy is pretty monstrous. Clearance as well as that. Hey, you're. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can probably make 
Convicts loose. Lobster bills. Holy ground for dad. Nestled beneath sky pheasant. Lives a monster of a good meal. Pretty sure I know which monster he means. Know this place? The art space on the Upper East Side. No letter enters this artsy castle without stopping at the gate. Woo boy! Bob's the beat. Home away from home. Always reminded me of the Graham's kitchen down south. Keep your mom here on our first visit. Just about every date after that. Even once when she was pregnant. And she went into labor right before the end. I blame the community. She was less of a fan after that. But I'm not gonna lie, son. Some of those nights working late. Yeah. I'm stopping in for some driving. Okay. Mom totally knew you were stopping here. Let him have his secret. They were a good team. <laughs> Sorry about that. You know how it is. So you're not taking a break now that you're back? Nope. Speaking of which, I'm not gonna be swinging behind you constantly looking over your shoulder now that I'm back. I trust you. And I have some stuff I should take care of. Like what? Can I help? I need to find a job. Freelancing with the Bugle was great, but I'd like something steady. Have you thought about teaching? You're pretty good at it. <laughs> Honestly, no. No. Maybe. I'll think about it. I'll call you soon. There's the art space. Okay. No letter enters this artsy castle without stopping at the gate. Should check the gates around the building. Next clue. Nice. Oh, CJ Walker Park. I knew this place up in Harlem. Beneath the hoop where you learn to fly, your journey comes to an end. Man, not ready for this to be over. Middle school graduation. You and Finn joked it felt like a royal coronation when we saw the art space building. Your mom and I were so proud. Our son and our almost daughter graduating at the top of their class. I know it made you sad. Both of you go to different high schools. But Miles, I'll tell you, the friendships you make when you're young. The real ones? Those guys. You and Finn will find each other. Maybe a few years down the line, maybe a few decades. One crew left. But you can't wait to get to the end. Finn and I did find each other again. Just not the way Dad thought. Got another crime report. Weapons deal. Huh. Mom 
Adam's Rock, this is it. C.J. Walker Park. Beneath the hoop, where you learn to fly, the journey comes to an end. Oh, this hoop here. This is the last one. Man, so many memories. And so we come to the end. C.J. Walker Park. Remember when we played ball here in the summers? Your uncle showed you how to take it to a rack. Well, I demonstrated how to throw it down with a fork. Don't think I'll ever forget watching you and Finn trying to alley-oop to your mom. This place reminds me that as crazy as life gets, only one thing really matters. The people you love. You, your mom, Finn, Genki, even your uncle. Keep the folks you care about close to your heart, and you'll never go wrong. Happy birthday, big man. You are my reason for being brave. Oh, man. I was not ready for that. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, Mom. I just finished your scavenger hunt. Thank you so much for putting it together. For a little while, it was like he was back. He never left me, home. I love you. I love you, Ma. Well blocked. Well, I'll stop here. Thank you for watching.